It isn't often you hear about LMPD's River Patrol Unit. Uh, 10 4. Uh, we're in the area. But every day. We're out every day, uh, 10 hours a day. Uh, we're out 365, seven days a week. They cover more ground than you'd imagine, patrolling a nearly 40 mile stretch of the Ohio River. We've responded to, to incidences in, uh, in Oldham County and uh, as far south you know, as Meade County and, and Hardin County. River Patrol Commander Sergeant Jeff Artman says while many think they're just out to give boating tickets, a lot of what they do is focused on safety. Our main goal, I guess, is everybody's safe, nobody drowns, no boat accidents. Artman says the rules of the water are similar to the rules of the road. We do, uh, you know, BUI, which is boating under the influence, any kind of uh, boating safety uh, like registration or safety as far as like having life jackets and things like that or some kind of reckless boating. LMPD's four-man river patrol unit is equipped with five boats plus some flood boats. Their most common calls are boaters in need of help and bridge jumpers. Uh, we'll basically sit below and if, uh, if, uh, if they happen to jump, uh, we'll be ready to, to rescue. Uh, we'll have some, uh, a ring or some kind of life buoy to throw them. Grab the ring! Uh, we'll jump in if we have to. Two of LMPD's River Patrol officers are on the dive team. We put their skills to the test by tossing WDRB photojournalist Kyle Lizenby overboard. During the exercise, we learned they have several ways of rescuing someone. Right, give me your hand, sir. Of course, that depends on if they're, if they're conscious or if they have some kind of injury or not. The safest is an in-boat rescue where they use a stick or toss you a ring or they can send a diver after you. But they only jump in after someone if it's absolutely necessary. History has shown us that victims tend to panic. Sometimes they'll actually fight you. You're trying to help them. They'll sometimes try to fight you. Our planned rescue was successful, but often when searching for a missing person or a body, because the water is murky and the river is deep and wide, the task isn't as easy. Team as well, we've got a, a sonar, We've got an underwater camera and uh, one underwater large metal detector. And the river patrol unit is busier than ever now with Louisville utilizing its waterfront park more often. Uh, during concerts that are on waterfront park in the Great Lawn, we'll have a lot of people that actually anchor in the path of the, in the, path of the, the barges and the towboats, uh, the navigational channel. Uh, so it's really important if you come down for an event like that, um, to, to try to stay as close to shore as you can. Even if it's not in the water necessarily, we're, we're still out usually at those events. As summer comes to an end, most boaters will turn in for the season, but LMPD's River Patrol Unit never takes a break. We're, we're out uh, every day, even in the winter. In Louisville, Emily Muir, WDRB News.